Hello, I'm Professor Know-It-All and you're watching Toolbarn University. Today we're exploring the difference between green and red laser levels. Now each kind of laser has their advantage and disadvantage. A green laser, for instance, is 400% more visible than a red laser indoors. In fact, green is the easiest color to see for humans, so to us, green would seem brighter. Now a green beam has a similar diameter than the red beam, and it's less common. So you can use it in the same room as a red beam without really getting the two confused. Now the interesting thing about green lasers is that they don't really exist. See, to generate a green laser, you start with a high-powered infrared laser diode, and then through a complicated process, you convert the invisible beam to visible green. This process generates a lot of heat. So if you leave the laser on too long, it'll automatically shut off to prevent damage to itself. Because of all this extra hassle, green beams are more expensive than red beams. The red beams are just produced by the diode, or there are no conversions involved. So that's why you can find them at the department store for about $10. Now one common question is which laser level is better to use outside? Again, a green laser is easier to see with the human eye, but when you're using it outside, the difference is really minimal. In fact, if you're gonna use a laser level outside, we recommend using a laser detector. Now laser level systems are a great time saver on the job site as nothing is better than having the precision of a laser. If you're looking for a bright laser that stands out in the crowd, well go ahead and get yourself a green one. It'll be a little bit easier to see. If you're looking for some uh, way to save money and you want that classic laser level look, uh, go with the red one. Well that's all the time we have for today. The next time we'll be talking about cordless battery technology. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you next time at Toolbarn University.